Hey guys, so I came across this really cool tip um, with, uh, for painting your fingernails and it has to do with using opaque polishes and um, a matte finish or base coat to kind of help keep the color true to itself. I know sometimes when you use an opaque polish like Essie's um, Accrued Interest or something that's just a little more um, just opaque, you tend to get like streaking in the finished nail color and so using a fi uh, a matte finish top coat or a matte finish, finish base coat kind of helps keep the polish true to color. And so I love fingernail polish and you know it seems like I have a new polish on my nails every other day, every other week, you know, so it's just a really cool interesting tip that I thought I'd share. So basically all you do is you paint you can use a base coat, normally I don't use a base coat, but when painting your nails with the polish, you just go ahead, and I'll just do one now just to kind of show you guys an example. Um, you do your first coat, and you let that dry, but your first coat is kind of going to look a little bit like this. I don't know if you can see it, but see there's kind of just some streaking in it because it is such like a... Um, a light pastel kind of opaque color it's not completely transparent but it is kind of just one of those lighter colors so then you're gonna wait for that to dry okay so now that it's dry then all you do is you take a matte finish like this is Sinful's uh, matte finish and this is actually new it, I've never seen it out before um, at Walgreens or anywhere else. I checked Walmart and Walmart didn't have it or Target. So I know you can find it at Walgreens, Rite Aid, CVS, and just most places that they carry sinful nail colors. And so um, all you do is after the first coat, you go ahead and you use the sinful um, or you use this matte finish coat on top of it and then you just let that dry and so it is still kind of streaky and so this matte finish coat whenever it dries it should help the next coat adhere to your nail a little bit better so let's wait for it to dry. Okay, and so now that the matte finish has dried on top, now you're gonna take the color again and you're just gonna paint it on top of that. So it's kind of like a three-step process. And then when you're done with this, you're going to um, use a top coat to just you know really give it that shine. Oh, it works so much better. So now that you've used that matte finish coat and actually let it dry, now you'll see that in the finished product it is just completely smooth and it doesn't have that streaking that it did before and uh, it was just such a great tip that I had to share it with you guys just because I got really excited when I learned about it and I was like, oh, that's so wonderful. So the first thing I did was I ran out and I tried to find some of this um, matte finish and so it really works and it really looks good instead of having to do five or six or however many coats or just trying to pack it on to avoid that um that streaking look that you do tend to get with um with pastel or opaque nail polishes okay and then once this is kind of dry a little bit then you can use CG Beats um, top coat which I absolutely love I've used it probably for about two and a half years now I, no, almost more than three years, but I love it. I love it. It just, you can use it and it dries your nails so quickly. It makes your polish last so much longer. And I tell all my friends about it just because I feel like this stuff is the greatest. I go through this stuff like crazy. So then you just put that on top of your polish. Mine's getting a little sticky because I've had it for so long already. Something I also like to do with the CGV clear coat is when you're done, go across the top of your nail also, and it's going to seal that polish so that way it doesn't chip 
as quickly as it normally would and so your nail polish will last a little bit longer. That's also another cool trick. So there you go. That's your finished nail and sometimes I do get it on my skin a little bit on the outside of my nail but I really don't even let that bother me just because I can wash it off in the shower and then it seems like the polish just looks that much smoother because it's com covering your entire nail and you're not missing the sides of it or anything like that so anyways um, that was just my cool tip and hopefully it, you guys find it useful and are as excited about it as I was <laughs> so anyways have a great weekend and I will see you soon bye